We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. How many of y'all young NBA young boy fan? You know I'm right here, bro. You know what I mean? I'm definitely riding with come on, bro. <laughs> so you be you be keep what was going on with your boy, man? He just got locked up. This man is on house arrest in West Bubblefuck and got arrested. You got an image, bro. First of all, don't come up to Grave, Grave Mountain, Grave Digger Mountain, bro. Don't do that, bro. You know what I mean? Don't, I'm don't, just trying to figure mean, out, like, yo, he... Uh, I, I was looking for Grave Digger Mountain when I was out in Utah, bro. Listen, oh. this man was in the middle of nowhere and still got arrested on drug, weapons, and identity fraud charges. How? Like, so, I, I brought this up because this is like a reflection of the young generation in a sense like a lot of people that are uh, and i don't want to like make it seem like i'm old head but I, i'm pretty much an old head right <laughs> you met like you you are. broke you, you you got out we of are. trouble you was on house arrest right so you kind of beat the eyes right you would still be able to do what you want you were still able to move and groove you had your shorty you was doing your music yeah you couldn't come and go as you please but for the shit that you said you put in the work and all that, you still kind of had your freedom. How do you get arrested for drugs, weapons, and identity fraud from your house? Please talk to me. Let me know what's going. How? Like, what, what is the concept for you? Yeah, the drugs was in his house. The weapons <laughs> was in his house. <laughs> <laughs> some identity fraud was on some transaction online. I'm pretty sure they got all that. Right, pretty sure they yeah they got all that. Yeah, I mean. Like so that's that's great. Like so. because he can't go out, somebody had to bring the drugs into him because he couldn't go get them. So that's right. how the drugs got there. Right. Okay. Bro. Um, the guns he's shooting videos, but he needs guns in his videos. So whoever brought well, he can't because he's technically video, a felon, so he's not supposed to have real guns. Well, technically he had real guns, so they must have brought him the guns. I'm sure you asked how they got them. Right. He's okay. trying to give you okay. a yeah, idea okay. of, you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> and identity fraud, that could be anything, bro. <laughs> All right. So here's my synopsis. I think he was doing a lot of dumb shit on the internet under somebody else and thinking he was going to get away with it. He was ordering drugs online, probably the guns, like you said, online under a whole different name. And he probably ordered from the wrong person, was probably a fed. <laughs> and they showed up to his front door. Like, ain't you on house arrest? So, <laughs> so you so, you saying NBA young boy did all that? He ain't had no friends that could have did that for him. My, I, that's why I'm confused. Like, this is what he's charged for. So that's the, that's why I'm like dumbfounded, right? If you charge with all this, that means you were doing some shit, right? So if I if, I, if I'm on house arrest and I'm a millionaire, I got the, I got my minions doing what I got to do, right? They get caught up, they might mention my name, right? But I'm not actually doing anything, right? So I'm just affiliate. You know, they could say I did right. such such and such, but when you get identity fraud, then it's like you were pur- you were proposing that you were somebody else completely else doing shit. Yeah. So when they tie it up with the music, the, with the, the drugs and or guns, that means you was over there trying to buy shit under somebody else's name. Yeah, <laughs> you know, so like the mentality yeah. you gotta have for that. Like, like I don't get it. Like that's why I, I'm I'm reaching out for like some type of explanation or I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna tell you this NBA young boy is definitely missing a few screws. <laughs> so Lord knows what he was doing, bro. Up there, bro. I know one thing, he's been working a lot of rappers been free. This man been in the house out work out working people for a long time. So that stuff will drive you crazy, bro. You don't know yeah, what what's going on with him, bro. I I tried to understand it. I don't understand it, but his work ethic is like none other. And he's NBA young boy, he's he's ready to dumb out every time, bro. Maybe jail might be good for him. And no, no, you know what I mean. I, I don't wish jail jail on nobody, but him, bro. He was just going at it with what's his name like a week ago, bro. So he's he's, I don't know, bro. I yeah, don't that's, know. That's that's, bro. that's wild. Like just just to be wow. He's the definition of wow. Like you, how you get three charges on house arrest and you didn't even leave your house? Yeah, that's insane. That is. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like that's just that's crazy. Like 
I don't know, but I, I wanted to mention that. I ain't going to drag out on to him because, I mean, I know that's your boy, young, a young boy and everything. Um, I wanted to mention that, bring some aware to it that you need to be on your P's and Q's. If you're going to be in that life, like, you got to move smarter than you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I, they've been telling him that forever. But I mean, yo, he's, he's NBA. Yo, yo, listen, he's he got a he got a fan base. They love that. They they rock for him. They rock for him. I said that from the start. You got an image yeah. up on. Yeah, they rock for him. And he's he really is loose. He was just arguing with a dude. What's what's my boy's name? Oh uh, man, I forgot my god name. He was arguing with him over a girl. He was like, I'm about to crash out on you. Da da da. He like, yo, bro, I'm not fighting over no girl, bro. Like, you got it, bro. He still didn't. NBA young boy was not trying to hear that, bro. He like that yeah, with everybody. He, yeah, he ain't got no off switch. Yeah, he has no off switch, bro. On, on it ain't just for entertainment, bro. That mm. he needs to be, you know what I mean? He needs to be. Him and Kodak mm. Black, bro. Them some Kodak Black, nah, Kodak a little more controlled than young. No, boy, yeah, Kodak Black is a jailbird too, bro. He, no, no, he be wilding, jail. but he's they a lot more jail. controlled. I ain't gonna lie, the dude, yeah. dude, they love Kodak Black, love jail. He jail, bro. He just got yeah. out, bro. Like. <laughs> they gotta that's they they you know what I mean that's they thing man I don't know man listen I mean I if you got if you had to say something to the you what would you say like to, to try to help him to him to, and just the youth because you because when you when you when it's deeper than this right so when you look at it like there's people that look up to him that probably love this oh my boy young boy is real about that and they and they try to like mimic that what would you say to that like how um, would you address that like for example you got two boys and one of them are like yo i want to be like young boy i'm not saying that's that we know that's not true but just saying like that image that he uh, young boy and you see what young boy is going through and in, in the image he portrays how do you address that nah you ain't, nigga, you ain't gonna be like young boy you're gonna be like daddy nigga i'm right here the fuck right, I'm bro. Bro. Right, yeah yeah, right, yeah. You yeah, going to be like, Yo, what the fuck am I doing? This? Right, like, why am I here? <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah, but you, you know how like they, they idolize these famous uh, people, these famous. But if I, I just, but if I, I just had an argument with one of our family members about um, old block about Chief Keith and and Young Dirk, right? And who was the biggest, the bigger artist at the current time? And and strategic you was part of this this conversation yeah, never said, I mean, yeah we was part of this conversation right but the no, idolization no, no, no. what the fuck no no nah, nah, i'm not putting because you did that's not necessary but nah, but it, it's no talk, way how y'all go listen y'all talk about people that don't know music and we sit here talk about chief keith in 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 dirk who had yeah. the bigger obviously the whole conversation is foo-foo because yeah there's no Nobody that really knows music. There's no way. What was this conversation? No, we, what we were saying is right now, uh, Little Dirk is bigger than Chief Keef. And the deny on that was like, no, he's not. And I'm like, we're we not taking what Chief Keef done and what he represents. Like, he represents Chicago, right? We're taking right now, Dirk is bigger than. No, no, no. And it, it, But it, the reason I mentioned that was the idolization of Chief Keef. The, the side that it was chosen. And I'm using that as an example of somebody can do the same thing with NBA young boy, right? The idolization that the, he can't do no wrong. Nobody better than him. That that's what I'm trying to like click with. I, I use that, uh, use that situation to show how it relates back to NBA young boy. Lil Durk is popping right now, but he's not as big as chief Keith was. Was yes. No, but just the acknowledging me as saying that right was offensive. Because of the idolization, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? That that's all. I, that's the whole thing I was trying to say. I'm like, yo, ain't nobody say, nigga. I know Chief Keef when he had all this shit, and he was yeah, not showing up to videos bro. and all. Word, you know what I'm saying? Bro. But right now, Chief Keef, I mean, running around crazy. But anyway, I just I was using that as an example of idolization and how it could. But go they wrong. times is different, so I understand that. It's like it's yeah. like us, Michael Jordan versus LeBron, bro. Yeah. They go look at you like you crazy, like yo, yeah, Mike that's ain't, a fact. LeBron ain't better than Mike, like because uh, those are yeah. two different times, and it's always gonna be that argument, right? So, but yeah, yeah, we gonna we gonna talk about that. Um, I mean, we 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 not gonna talk about, it, but we talked about that, and I just wanted to give an example on that. Um, that's all I really got. No, hold on, my advice for the kids, yo, my advice for the kids is be yourself. Yeah, be yourself. That's it. Like we don't we don't 
tell the kids that enough. Be yourself, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, we say that, but we don't. When they look at you, you got to be the example. You know what I mean? We we have to be the example. The the thirty year olds have to be the example. The twenty five year olds have to be the example. Be yourself. If your kids see you not being yourself, why would they want to be themselves? You know what I mean? So make it cool to do cool stuff again. You know what I mean? Make it cool to do. You know what I mean? Instead of idolizing that, you know what I mean? Take them fishing. You know what I mean? Take them kids. Everybody, you when you growing up, we all. I love the, I seen people on the block, so I like the block. I seen people move in some type of way, so I try to do that, even though it's not even me, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's what that's what you idolize. That's what you yeah. see. You I see holding weapons. I'm like, yo, let me try that. You know what I mean? We gotta make it cool to do other stuff. We preach that we trying to, but we're not showing that because we still be acting rah rah rah. Uh, you know what I mean? We gotta say, nah, that ain't cool, bro. Just fall back on that. You know what I mean? Yeah, can I speak on that though? Um, like Strategic said, when I asked him the question, he said, forget idolizing young boy, idolize me. But that's a, a good heavy example. Feat. Yeah, it is. It's definitely a good example, right? Good father. But that's a heavy feat for the kids, right? Because they idolize these famous people. Right? No, it's not. Same- no. No, it's well, not. No. I get what you're about to say. Okay. But the difference is, is yo, killer is not just telling them that, killer's playing a game with them. Killers mm-hmm. doing things with them so they can idolize him. Like, yo, my pops is like the coolest person. If you ever heard someone tell a story about their pops that really That's like, they yo, my pops is my biggest hero. That's because he was actually there walking them through the steps. They did. He just didn't tell them. Like I said, we talk a lot. Like as human beings, as men, we talk. We talk a good one, boy. But half of us is not walking that. You know what I mean? And we have to walk that path that we talking. You know what I mean? I see it all the time. My some of my friends will be I'm not gonna say their name, but they part of the gang culture. If you don't want your kids to be part of the gang culture, you cannot oh, represent that in front of them. You can't be throwing up that in front of because they very impressionable. Mm-hmm. And when they see they only they're gonna I my eyes led cool. me. You know what I mean? Yeah. What I seen around me led me. You know what I mean? What what was cool? Oh, I seen him not going to school. So going to school is for weirdos? Oh, I'm not doing that today. I'm 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 ditching school because that's the cool thing to talk about later. You know what I mean? I didn't have nobody saying, yo, go to class. Actually, I did. Killer used to tell me all the time, yo, what are you doing? But but you yeah. get what I'm saying? Like, yo, I would ditch yeah. school because I was like, yo, that ain't cool to be there, bro. I ain't in that at trying to be down, bro. And I can say that that works on the opposite side too. Whereas you see the negatives and you don't want that. You know what I'm saying? You see, like, you gave a perfect example of all the positives, but if you grew up in a, in a surrounding and you see all the things that you don't want, like, yo, okay, I see this is what they did. It never worked out. Like, I see them making money, but it never worked out. And I don't know. You don't nobody learn that until later, though. Nah, that, for, for, me, for me personally, I looked at all the things that I didn't want. Like when for I right, so let me give let me give an example on that. I looked at like everybody in my family being locked up except me, including my both my little brothers. So when I was growing up, I'm like, I see that didn't work. I'm not doing that shit. Oh, I see that didn't work. I'm not doing that shit. So I had a different mentality going into shit. So that's also that's not necessarily bad because it turned out good on that. Like okay, shit, I ain't seen nobody go to college, bro. I'm gonna go do this. It might not be cool, but fuck it, I'm gonna go do it. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go. You know what I'm saying? That, that's yeah, what I'm yeah, saying. Like it could be. Yeah, nobody. But they didn't praise you the way you should have. I, yeah. I when you lie, I said, "Yo, when when not to make this a personal thing, but mm-hmm. when I seen you doing certain things, I said, oh, that's fire. I get it.' But everybody don't have that insight. It's yeah. just sneakers, bit you know, bitches, <laughs> and you know what I mean, making it through the day, day, gang, gang, day, gang. Yeah, day, that's day, all it is. Day to day, no future. You're not cool. You. Like you're not cool. That to them, like you know what I'm saying. Yeah. We're not cool by saying, "Yo, I'm the, I'm going to work," or "I'm da da da." Well, now it is. You know what I mean? Because we getting better people in the world. Look at yeah. as a prime example. Look at Wolf. Yeah. Going to look at yourself. You y'all are prime examples of actually walking the walk. You know what I mean? Gotcha, gotcha. But yeah. Damn, we went deep on that one. <laughs> it's real. <laughs> it's real. Yeah. I'm telling you, listen, all of my friends, ha- not not my brothers, a lot of people, all of my friends, they talk that good talk. Oh, mm-hmm. I'm trying to do this, but they negative. They out yeah. there gangbanging, standing on corners, 
and ain't yo you got to get it how you get it that's the that's the other side of me get it how you live but we do have to set an example for these kids like we have to be the example you cannot tell him yo you're not supposed to be out here go to school mm -hmm. but you out there that's we got to take the initiative bro that is a fact 